So today it's our first day of back to school for uh, the vast majority of our schools. We're here today at uh, Franco Cité, uh, our biggest high school in the school board and ready to host our students for the first day back to school. Obviously the first day of school, it's excitement for everyone, you know, uh, even as a superintendent, we have this, uh, uh, we feel nervous and it's, it's positive energy and I know the staff and the students are, are looking forward to get back. The students haven't been here since April, uh, so for them they're excited to f see their friends. Uh, even though they're all be wearing masks and all the uh, uh, measures will be in place, it's very exciting. You can feel the vibe this morning. So a lot of the measures from last year are, are still in place in the school. Uh, the admin staff here has divided the school up into different cohorts uh, where students will interact within that cohort only. Uh, you know, if I summarize it, uh, basically it's per, per level. Uh, and it, it, it can vary from school to school depending on the size uh, of the school. But all their plans have been approved by the superintendent of the school. Uh, and uh, so that's a measure that's in place. Uh, we're happy to see that extracurricular activities will be coming back uh, shortly within our schools. So we'll, we'll have a little bit more interaction and school uh, spirit uh, brought back to us shortly. So that's very exciting. Uh, masks are again uh, obligatory within the school, but students when, when they're outside and they're able to maintain social distancing, uh, even within a gym class, and they're able to take off their masks. So a lot of the measures are back, uh, and we're encouraging students to wash their hands as they come into the school. Uh, every morning, they're disinfecting their hands. So these measures are still in place to offer them a safe environment.